I just wanted to share this with you. Codecs are a bit of a pain sometimes because people try to compress things, change things a little bit uh, for, for different reasons. But I always find the K-Lite packs pretty useful. So if you just go to free codecs, etc., etc., I will add this link in the bottom of the YouTube uh, video. But basically, just click on it, download it. It's running a little bit slow. Download it, install it, and most of your problems will disappear overnight. Because this machine I'm on at the moment hasn't been updated since 2012. I know some people update their machines more regularly than that, but this is a bit of a beast. It's a um, quite well-built server with a ridiculous amount of memory and stuff on it, which works well for video. But anyway, you just get the downloads going, which currently is very, very slow at doing. Still waiting. There we go. Just save the file. And you see, it's going to be 24 minutes. There you go. Nine minutes. <laughs> Shoots down rather quick. Okay, so I finally downloaded the um, codec pack. And now we're about to install. One of the first things I would say is take the old version off if you've got an older version. Because um, it will clean it up. Uh, I'm going to remove the settings as well. Cause I don't actually use any specific settings for this PC. It's basically just the settings that come with the original code, codec pack. Okay, so I just took the old one off. And we're going to update it with a new one. I say I'll just leave it as normal. Uh, that's fine. Next, next. 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 Accept, accept, accept. And the way it'll go, it'll install this software, and hopefully when you use Movie Player or anything else, you won't really get any problems, because you should have nearly all the codecs that you'll need to play anything. Alright, thanks for watching.